Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm in my very messy office right now that has not been organized still. I don't know, we've lived here for over a month now, I think, and there are so many boxes that still haven't been unpacked. The boxes in the kitchen, like in that little breakfast nook, which we decided we're not even gonna turn into a breakfast nook and put a table there, it's gonna be a downstairs like play section that we're gonna put a gate across because Adeline's gonna start crawling within the next couple months and we need somewhere downstairs that they can play like while we're cooking and doing stuff downstairs. So, I have been searching the house top to bottom to find my, I needed a new uh, primer and I went with uh, my friend Amanda a couple days ago to the mall specifically for this primer and I have been tearing the house upside down, could not find it. I was like, man, I must have thrown it away in the bag because I got Skyla a new pair of mini Melissa's that are just the cutest thing you've ever seen. Then we got a Build-A-Bear and then this. So these are the three things that I got. And I remember throwing that box away and I was like, I mean, not the box, the big bag. And they put everything in one bag and I was like, no way, I threw this away. And I have been waiting to get this because it's always sold out every time I go. So I was so excited to use it and it was nowhere to be found, but I found it in the bottom of my diaper bag. And if you're wondering what it is, it's the Bobby Brown, Bobby Brown, the Bobby Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. And every time I look for it, it's sold out. And it wasn't this time. So I'm about to try it out. Okay, everyone is awake and we're playing in the playroom. Skyla needs a hair tie and her hair brushed. And we need to cut your bangs again. Oh, we need to make an appointment for that and a dentist appointment. Thank you. Good morning, Zell. Good morning. We can put some books in your bookshelf today. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good morning, Adeline. Good morning, Adeline. <laughs> Do you like your toys? I see that little tooth. I see that little tooth coming out. cleaning brush, honey. Not for your hair. Do you want me to brush your hair? I'll go get the hair brush. We need to put, pull your hair back. It's everywhere. Don't brush Stell. She doesn't need to be brushed, honey. Mm -hmm. Good girl. Adeline, your belly's coming out of that shirt. <laughs> if you were wondering if I like the Bobbi Brown face base, it's amazing. Hi! It smells. Hi! It smells citrusy and it's Bye bye. Amazing. Bye bye. It smells so good and it feels really good and it worked really well. So I am on board with the Bobby Brown face base. Go. We need to put more batteries in that horse, don't we? More batteries in the horsey. We just got this Elsa decal from eBay and it's not really like staying stuck. I have one more coming from Etsy. I don't know where to put it yet. It just depends on how big it is when it gets here because this looked a lot bigger online and I did not like take measurements or anything, but it works for above the bookcase. The rest of the books are out here. I'm gonna bring the books in now so we can start putting them on the shelf. So here's our first round of books. The rest are still in the garage.
Got the shopping cart oh queue over here. Good job. You did it. Good job. Uh oh. So this is what our playroom looks like right now. I I don't know. I think they had some cubbies right there. We should probably get some too. Uh, but this is our playroom. I think there's still more toys that are in storage. To be Yay! honest. Um, I'm pretty sure there are more toys still in storage, but um, I think the toy, the playroom is awesome. Like now, I don't think we can ever have a house without a playroom. After seeing how awesome it is to have one room dedicated to all the kids' stuff, this is supposed to be a media room, but I like it way better as a playroom. It's so fun. Skyla, can we find all the rings that go on this toy? Careful, whoa, careful. We need to find a yellow ring. Um, Skyla colored on this table. I didn't know she had a crayon up here and she colored on this table But you can get this out with magic eraser if anyone has crayon stains magic eraser will do the trick for sure So we need to find which one do you want to do? Okay, so we're missing the rhino on this one um, So we need to find a rhino a T-Rex and a circle. That's the scavenger hunt for today. And you're just over here being quiet and calm like a good girl with your little belly hanging out. I just looked in every single one of the bins in there and the puzzle pieces are nowhere to be found. So they're most likely just somewhere else in the house, maybe under the couch or something. So I dumped out every bin in that playroom just now. I got the house kind of picked up because it was pretty rough today. So. I'm, I've picked up pretty much everywhere except for the back like patio area and our room and bathroom. So once they go down for their nap, which is going to be in just a little bit, I'm going to start working on our bedroom and the bathroom. And then later on this evening, or later on today, while we're outside, I'm going to work on picking up outside because it looks like a bomb went off everywhere. Adeline is having some peas right now. <laughs> Yeah, you're having peas? This is her second meal. Well, meal. This is her second solid of the day, but I've given her green beans both times. And it is store-bought, the Beech Nut Naturals. And um, I just wrote Wednesday, 12 p.m., because that's when I opened it, because it's good for two days after you open it. So we are enjoying our little lunch right now. I also mixed in some powdered probiotics into this. We're not doing the Gerber soup anymore. Don't you want some water? No, no water? This is going to take some getting used to, guys. I am filming on a new um, camera. So while I was filming feeding Adeline, my camera fell off of the countertop and broke. And it will not turn on at all anymore. It won't do anything. This is the power button right here, and it's like, it won't even, screen won't even come on. I can't even like look at my clips. It's just, it's completely done. So I went and got a new camera, and I was going to get the new uh, G7X, which is what I've been filming with since 2015 or 20, I think January 2016 is when I got this. And so I was going to get the, the new one, but then I get so many comments, well not 
not that many anymore, but in the beginning I used to get comments saying that I needed like an external mic so that when I was outside and like the wind was messing with my, uh, like the audio, that an external mic would help like muffle the wind noises and like any like noise that I don't want in my video, um, I needed an external mic. And so I asked the guy, there was a Canon expert at Best Buy, and I asked him um, if I could connect this mic. I found this like compact, it's a compact on camera mic, this. And I asked him if this would connect to my to a, the new Canon G7X, the Mark II, which is what I was gonna get. And he said it won't. And he's, but he said that this camera that I got, which is also a Canon, it's the Canon uh, M50. He said that um, I could I could attach this to this camera, that it's only a little bit bigger, and that um, it has great video and picture quality. So I decided to get this camera instead. It's a little bit bigger. It's honestly not awful, like the size difference. It is bigger because the lens you can take off in exchange for other lenses, so it is bigger and bulkier. But I think it's a good trade-off for better video quality and better audio quality. So what I got was, the camera, here's the box so you guys can see which one. This is what the box looks like. And then the mic I just showed you. And let's see what else I got. Oh, I got a case because it is a little bit bigger so I got this case to put it in. And this is what, I have a Nikon as well and I have this case just and just a little bit bigger for my Nikon. My Nikon is for photos, it's not for video. I filmed on it last time because my camera was giving me issues, like the Canon one that's broken now, it was giving me issues. So I tried to film on my Nikon, it was, it was not good. Like you guys saw the color balance was totally off. So the Nikon is strictly for like cameras. Um, I got this cleaning kit for free because there's like a promotion for like when you buy a certain amount of accessories like you get money off so this was pretty much free and then the last thing that I got was an extra battery so I'm really excited about this new setup and it's weird because the viewfinder is not on top like my other one is to the side but I'm really happy with it so far and you guys will have to let me know if you see a difference in video quality, um, yeah. Is the water warm? Is it warm? table and bench set that we got from Wayfair for Skyla. So I'm really excited to see that it's for the patio. Three, two, three. <laughs> go Zell, go Zell. Drop it, good job. Three, watch out Skyla, watch out. Three, <laughs> I took the external mic off because I want to see if there's any difference in video, um, I mean audio quality. I am in the patio so the wind is blocked a little bit, but Skyla just got this from Wayfair and it's so cute. Nick just put it together. Do you like it, Skyla? Yeah! Yeah? Yeah! That's fun. We can eat outside now. Yeah, well, that would be fun. Mama? Yes, baby. beautiful so I was just about to heat up a nurture life meal for Skyla and Nick walks out with a popsicle what do you think is it good good that's a strawberry banana one hot huh, from H-E-B it's a strawberry banana bomb pop I think 
A uh, pop? Bomb pop. But it looks yummy. Skyla had a nurture life meal for dinner. Nick gave her dinner and put her to bed and he also did bath time tonight. He came home from work early. And now Adeline is getting some apples and Nick is putting together the Bright Start Around We Go Play Center so that we have that tomorrow because it just came in the mail. Yeah. It is 8.30, Skyla went to bed at 8. And Adeline did do it, then she woke up. So we're giving her a little bit of food before we put her back down. My camera. Some water, sweetie? Good job drinking the water this time. This is her first time drinking water. And like I said earlier, it does have a splash of apple juice in it just for flavoring because I could not get her to drink plain water at all. The pediatrician recommended that I start giving her water and I wanted to give it to her in a sippy cup, but she will not take a sippy cup yet. So it's better just to, you know, get it to them. And in my opinion, just to get them the water any way you can at first and then we'll, we'll keep working on sippy cups. Oh my goodness, Adeline, look what Daddy put together for you. Wow, that's so fun. Adeline, that looks so fun. Does it have batteries in? No. Batteries? What? For the, that uh, musical thing right there. Oh my goodness, she likes it. That's so fun. That's so fun. Yay. This is the um, activity center that I was referring to in Adeline's six month update. Wow. My goodness. <laughs> okay we are going to bed we just watched another episode of 13 reasons why i've already seen the entire first season but nick hasn't watched it at all and i saw that the second season was out so i wanted to watch the whole first season with nick so we just finished watching the second episode and he didn't think he was gonna like it but he's hooked so um i will see you guys in my next video which will be a weekend vlog i think on Monday. Um, but as always, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, and make sure your bell notification is on. And I'll see you in the next video. Check out the links below um, for things that you've seen in today's video and all my videos in general. Bye.